Merry Christmas from the Philippines. Worship on Wheels has had a great year here, and we want to let you know about it in our minor motion picture. Here it is. This year, Worship on Wheels hosted seven weeks of Weird Animals Vacation Bible School, building relationships with about a thousand children and volunteer staff in seven different neighborhoods all over the Philippines. Our program served over 5,000 meals during that time with local volunteers in their own churches. Our feeding programs through Convoy of Hope Philippines have fed over 80,000 meals in weekly programs that include Bible story presentations. For those who don't know us, Ty grew up in the Philippines doing tribal missions from the time she was in high school until we married in 2005. I have been in the first responder field since the age of 18, serving as an EMT, police officer, and finally retiring from the Houston Fire Department in 2012. We both felt a call to missions on our trip to the Philippines in 2008. We planned to go there after our children were grown, but an accident in 2009 that almost took our son's life put us there in God's time. You can read more about that on our website. Working with UBC, our home church in Clear Lake, we felt a strong desire to take the same incredible vacation Bible school programs to the poorest children in the world. They all deserve to know the love of their Heavenly Father. We have experienced a lot of trials and a lot of errors, but God is faithful and continues to strengthen and guide us in what we do 9,000 miles from our home. We have also discovered that the needs are more abundant than the workers, as the Bible tells us in Matthew 9.37 and Luke 10.2. Worship on Wheels will begin a building project this year that is 90% funded. It's scheduled to be done by June of 2016, and we'd pray that we'd have an additional 12 to 15,000 in one-time gifts to finish it. The building will have many purposes. It will house our family and future families that will take our place as we occasionally furlough. It will house our two new vehicles, which are completely paid for. And it will warehouse the 24 tons of food that we send out every year through Convoy of Hope along with medical and school supplies and many other items that we acquire through God's provision. It will also provide a place for us to store and build the things we need for our many vacation Bible school programs. We will loan these out to churches as they become familiar with our VBS styles. Most importantly, it will house long and short-term mission teams that want to experience missions in the Philippines and also provide training for the local church volunteers that work with our programs. These volunteers will take our programs beyond our reach and multiply them every year. Our ministry has been so blessed here in the Philippines with so many partners. Convoy of Hope Philippines has given us food, disaster supplies, Tom's shoes, among other things. We've also been blessed with the partnership of Daryl and Tina Cheeks, who are also World Outreach missionaries. They provide food to the children in Mindoro, in the tribal areas. University Baptist Church, along with the Texas Baptist men, have been a great help, along with Southern Hills Baptist Church in Tulsa, and Christ for Humanity, giving us medical supplies for our medical missions. With the new facility, our reach will expand and our capabilities will multiply. We will also need an increase in our operating budget, approximately $1,500 per month. We would encourage you to consider prayerfully being a one-time or monthly giver to Worship on Wheels. As you can tell by the video, we've been very busy, and I think Worship on Wheels deserves to be on your nice list. If you'd like to give us a gift, please see our website, www.worshiponwheels.com. Drop us an email anytime, and maligayan pasko.